Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new way of the Hunter video and it's been a long time since we stepped foot on this game but I think this is the right time to come back and today I woke up, loaded up my PC, I was like right I'm gonna re record a way of the Hunter video today I was thinking in Steam, I was like uh, before I upload, um, loaded the game I was like what should I do a video on, what should I do a video on could do some hunting on Ticket Moon Plains and then I was like oh where the hunter's got an update, but there's no patch notes or anything. It turns out I was one of the first to see it, and I started updating, and then the patch notes dropped, and yeah, a brand new DLC, four new rifles. Now we'll go in here. I've already got them. I haven't got them equipped now, but here are the two rifles. That what I said before is technically wrong, but yeah, here are two rifles. We've got the Remington 700 Alpha One Hunter, which is a caliber of seven millimeters. PRC, I'm not sure what the PRC means, but it's a hunting tier 6, so biggest biggest tier in the game, so it's a fat, very powerful rifle. And we also have the um, Remington model 700 SPS, which is a 375 H&H Magnum, which is yeah, pretty big. And that is also another hunting tier 6, which are two very, very powerful rifles, which will be used on Alaska and Tikamu Plains, because they have the most tier 6 species. But yeah, some pretty cool. So, moving on from what uh, what we were using before, the SM12, Hunting Tier 6, 300 Win Mag. Moving on from that, moving on to the two new rifles. And can they outshine it today? We will see. And we also have the two new shotguns. The Remington Model 870 SPS Super Magnum, which is 12 gauge at Hunting Tier for 1 for birds. And we also have the Remington Model 870 Fieldmaster, which is a 12 gauge slug. So we can use that for self defense. So if you're hunting in Africa and you have a ton of Cape Buffaloes charging you, just use this. I know it's not tier 6, I know it's not correct for them, but it's going to get them down. And that is a capacity for its pump, so pretty fast wielding. And now I'll show the trailer. Show the trailer now. So you guys can have a look at that, see all the rifles in detail before we start shooting them. Welcome to the Remington Firearms Pack Showcase for Way of the Hunter. We've partnered with Remington Firearms to bring you an even greater selection and additional calibers. Introducing 375 h and H Magnum caliber with the model 700 SPS. From the rock-solid receiver design to the famous three rings of steel, the Model 700 SPS offers unrivaled out-of-the-box accuracy and high-end performance. Features include an improved ergonomically designed synthetic stock, carbon steel barrels and receivers drilled and tapped for scope mounts. All exterior metalwork features a matte black finish. Model 870 SPS Super Magnum Turkey Predator the most dependable slide action of all time in a design that will go the distance with deadly precision. Whether your target is the crease behind a buck's shoulder, a wily coyote, or a big red head. An all-inclusive camo package put together with devastating implications for birds at extended range and predators that close the distance. The Model 700 Alpha 1 Hunter maximizes the performance of the present-day ammunition with modern key features. A toolless takedown firing pin assembly, round receiver, fluted 5R barrel, threaded muzzle, precision ground recoil lugs, elite Hunter Timney straight trigger and AG composite carbon fiber stock. The Model 870 Fieldmaster Synthetic Fully Rifled Deer provides value and quality performance in one of the most accurate slug shooting combinations available. It includes a 20-inch fully rifled barrel with adjustable rifle sights. Matched to this is the satin black finish on all exposed metal parts and new synthetic stock and forend with supercell recoil pad. Make your choice from these four brand new Remington Firearms products and hunt your own way in Way of the Hunter. Right then, to start with, we have the Remington 700 Alpha 1 Hunter. Got the newest scope on it as well. And I think always, always do the trick. So to start off, we will go prone and we will just 
50 meters. Very accurate. It sounds amazing. Oh my god. It is not a very accurate rifle. I will. Oh, oh it's only got three. Whoopsies. Everything about this rifle sounds amazing. I think I'll just take a few shots with it and let you guys listen. That is a crazy sounding rifle. And if we were going to take a look at it in the photo mode... It's quite a simple design, the stock going through the shoulder a little bit there. That doesn't work. That's a pretty cool photo, seeing him load the rounds in. But it's a nice-looking rifle. It's quite big compared to... Let's, let's have a look at the one on the back, which is kind of going for him again. Yeah, they're, they're mostly the same colour, so they're like that black egg shelly colour. I think that's what it is. Either way, that's a nice... Um, don't even know what you call that. Gun knowledge is not, not doing me great right now. Um barrel nice and clean but it's a very nice looking rifle and it sounds amazing as well longer shot again 200 meters that's pretty dead on for 200 meters and we're, we're not even zeroed for 200 if we were to zero for 200 then pretty dead on now moving on to let's just reload this one moving on to the other one which is the 375 h and h it's Remington model SPS, uh, Remington 7 model 700 SPS, and this is it. This already looks more accurate than the other one, and that is, yep, yeah, that's that's pretty accurate. So we should be dead on at 100. Meters. Not regarding the wind, and now it's zero up to 150. Or oh, it won't let me. So okay. Yeah. So that I think that's enough shots while laying down. We need to test the accuracy while standing up. So the wind is quite... Up. And, oh, that's that's not great. But that was zeroed for 200. Uh, no, that was zero for 100. 200-meter shot. So now if we place the zeroing up to 200, let's see what we can do here. Oh, it's a bit wide. See, I'm not too sure about this one. It's a powerful rifle, but... They are going quite wide. Now the wind the wind is up there, it's 13.6. We can always try the range on this purse. But yeah, they're impressing me at the moment. I don't know which rifle sounds better. They both sound absolutely amazing. And if we swap back to the other one. Whoops, I kind of forgot how to play this game. I definitely think that this one sounds better. 100% sounds better. Yeah, the Remington 700 Alpha 1. Might just nickname it the Alpha 1 because that, that sounds pretty cool. Now the shotguns. Moving on to the shotguns. We have the Remington Model 870 SPS Super Magnum and the... Uh, Remington 870 Field Master. And can we put iron sights on these? Uh, I don't think so. Do I even have iron sights? So we have bows and stuff. Actually, I might run back to the house and see if I've got, uh, if I own any iron sights. Um, yeah, I'll be back in a minute. Okay, so it turns out I did not own any iron sights, which meant we couldn't equip them. Um, let's go back in now and yeah. Okay, so we can yeah, so we can equip. Let's equip the different ones on each. And this is the 870 SPS Super Magnum. I think this is the... Yeah, so this is the bird shooter. It's quite nice. It's a nice looking shotgun. Let's say following a bird. Yeah, that's nice. And if we were to shoot it without the iron sights... Um, yeah, okay, good. Right, shoot it without... 
Yeah, see, that's really nice. What does the zero wing go up to? It's five shots as well, so that helps. Um, okay, zero wing is just 25 meters. But... That's not bad. Right, now the other one uh, is the Model 870 Fieldmaster, which is what you would use as self-defense. So let's see animal coming at you. Does this go to any other? No, I think it's just 25, yep. But if we run into about, so if we get the binos out. So, yeah, it's about 25 meters now. So if you've got a, if you've got a cape or something stood out there running towards you. Let's say, because that's filled with dots, let's just... Okay, I presume that doesn't trap because you're not hitting the vitals. Um... There we go, this... That is, that is a very natural shot. Yeah. I'm very impressed with this. They're all four rifles sound absolutely amazing. And there will be another video of us hunting with them. I'm not sure if that might be today. Let's see if we can get them out. Yes, that is a very, very accurate rifle. Now, if we run into this one up here, because that one's full of stuff now. So help fast can you run with this yeah you can run normal speed while carrying the shotgun which is pretty nice so how far away are we from this one we are about 23 meters so if we back it up a little bit 25 meters exactly let's see how accurate this is very accurate yep <laughs> that is very very good Look at that, all dead on from where we shot in, some going a little high. Um, but yeah, I like this range, I do like it. It's, it's in the middle of nowhere, where it's by the lodge, and just like, it's a very, very nice area to shoot. What I will suggest is, rather than having a rock where it can spin off, maybe put the pile of logs down there. Um, but that's just me being a jerk. Um, but yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's a little bit of an in-depth guide into... Well, not really a guide, but an in-depth showing of all four new weapons. Two shotguns, two rifles. One shotgun now for self-defense. So defending against some of the animals that decide to rush us and try and kill us. We can now carry a shotgun with us and see if we can be safe. But yeah, I think the video later on today or tomorrow will be on... Tika Moon Plains as there is a lot of tier 6 animals there and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this one and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye!